Hello guys, in this tutorial I will be showing you how to create ladders. The biggest problem with the ladders is that the bots don't climb and many people have been puzzled of how this is happening. In this tutorial I will explain and show you how to get the bots to climb. So open up your hammer and load the map you want the ladder on. I'm going to use my tutorial to go ladder, it's a basic tutorial. Right, so it might look noticeable because it is one of the tutorials from um, Steams. So, first things first, create the ladder. So I'm going to click the entity tool, or entity tool, whatever, and um, click prop and just go static and go to your world model. Now there's lots of ladders, so loads will come up, but I'm going to write metal ladder, and I want metal ladder 002. MDL. OK, and I click apply. And then it quite basically just put it in place, but it's just the wrong way around for me, so I'm going to double click the object and rotate it 180 degrees. Or I could have done it manually by clicking on the object and then, yeah, but I'm happy where it is, so I'm just going to do that again. Right, and now I'm just going to line it up where I need it. Right, so there we go. And it's all pretty much sorted. So now that we've got the prop in place, now we need to make it a ladder. So you can. People tell you to do like. Funkin' to go ladder, but I'm gonna do a different way. So click a block, click the block tool, and draw in front of the ladder. Now, you may want to use Funkin' to go ladder because that's the Counter Strike way and. I use it for other map making programs, but for Left 4 Dead, it doesn't seem to work like that. So, find the texture, no draw, and change it texture to that by clicking this brick tool. Right, so now that we've done that, we now need to click this toggle application texture thing and click on the face of the ladder. Go browse and search ladder and look for this orangey reddish ladder sign and change the texture to that so the face of the ladder changes to that right so now that we have that in place that will be a ladder now some people like to name this Funkin' Skull Ladder so click control T Funkin' Skull Ladder but it's not really compulsory really you don't need to do that but I'm going to do it anyway right so now we've got that in place I'm going to save my map and I can compile it so once compiled, yeah, it's done. I'm not letting it run my game, so I'm going to run the game now. So quite basically, you have the ladder in place, and it will allow survivors to climb it, but not bots, which is a very key problem with most people's games. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to load up my map, map tutorial, and it's called ladder. So quite basically it's going to load the map, and it's done it. Right, so the nav editing ain't done for me, so I'm going to just do this again for those who have forgot or maybe want to see it again. So SVG needs to be set to 1, then write in nav and just go edit, so we can edit the nav. Then make sure you're looking at the floor when you write nav and just go mark and just go walkable. And then just generate, so nav and just go generate. So it'll then compile the map, fix, find all the walking spots, sniper spots, hiding spots. Yeah, so then you get all these lines and everything, but the bots will be able to work. So, so if I'm just going to just show you now, because the bots can work now, and I'm going to climb this ladder, but the bots will not be able to. See, I can, but the bots just seem to want to go to the safe room. So, this is where I show you. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to open up my console and write in nav underscore build underscore ladder while facing the ladder. Now you can see this yellow line thing comes up. That means that the ladder is in place. Now you don't write nav underscore generate again. You write nav underscore analyze, which got me stuck because I was doing generate and it wasn't working for me. So once you've done that, just do what you normally do. Navin's good GUI. 
and in this box comes up, click place, flood select, attributes, mesh edit, file, quit. And then the box should climb it. So if we have a look, I can certainly climb it. But let's see if the box can. Yes, they can. So that's pretty much this tutorial. Make sure you turn your SP cheats off and restart the map, and then it's all looking good for you. So I hope you enjoy, guys. Good luck with your mapping.